Hi guys, welcome to Top Mama. Today's tutorial is how to make slime or gook or gack or yucky stuff, I don't know. This is what the substance is and um, it's loads of fun for the kids. My kids enjoy it very, very much and it's super easy to do. Um, the whole project costs less than $20 and if you're having a birthday party, you can actually use this as the activity for the kids at the kids table. So let's begin. What you need are four simple ingredients. You need water, Elmer's glue, tempera for the color, and borax. Yeah, I know, you're probably wondering what the heck is borax. I didn't know what borax was anyway, but apparently it's an all-natural laundry booster and you can find it at Target. So just call ahead to your local Target and then go pick some up. Some of the recipes online say that you can use food coloring. I prefer to use this washable paint. Food coloring is a mess and it gets all over the place and it, and it does stain. The project takes two minutes and let's begin. So I've pre-measured half a cup of hot water and I'm going to add a tablespoon of borax. Okay, so once I have a tablespoon of borax, I just go ahead and mix it up and dissolve it in the water. Next, you wanna have half a cup of water and you're gonna put half a cup of Elmer's glue. This is the step that you add tempera paint if you want to add color. So just go ahead and add half a cup of Elmer's glue to half a cup of water and add the desired amount of color. So you can see that I've added the color and just go ahead and mix this around and you're kind of dissolving the the Elmer's glue. Once that's good and mixed and the color that you want, just add the borax solution to this cup and go ahead and mix that. And this is going to take about two minutes to do the final mixing. You'll start to feel it solidify and get clunky and chunky. The longer you mix, the better, really. So after a couple of minutes, you can see here that it's starting to solidify and become gooey. I just use a cookie sheet to kind of lay the gook on and you're going to want to wait about five to ten minutes before the kids start playing with it because it's a little sticky and messy right now. I mean if you're down for that then go for it but the longer you wait the better it gets. This is actually Gap or goo or whatever. I mean, yesterday and it has like the perfect consistency and it doesn't really stick much to your hands. If it does, then you just grab it and you know clean it up with its um, like that. So that's it. It's super easy and fun to do. My kids love it. And if you're looking for a kids' activity at a birthday party, this is a perfect activity for them. Get a bunch of colors of the tempera, put it in the middle. Get rollers, cutters. Um, containers for them to put it in and it's a fun thing to do. I guarantee you they will love it. Obviously your kids should be supervised when they're playing with this stuff. God forbid they swallow it, chew on it, put it in their eyes, whatever. Um, you know it says all natural but obviously I mean it can't be good. Even though you're using a tablespoon of it, I wouldn't want my kids doing that. So watch your kids and make some slime. It's super fun. Thanks for watching.